Hey guys, for this let's let you give, give some guys quick updates here about Google Plus, about the apps. If you have a smartphone, you obviously can go ahead and install from the Android market if you have the Android smartphone. I'm not sure what kind of devices it's compatible with, but you should be able to see it. But yeah, Android 2.1 and up, uh, if, at least if you have Google Plus right now, I got an invite, but I can't really use it right now because they were like closed down that system, so that kind of sucks, but hopefully it will be up and running in a couple of days. But uh, yeah, if you're an Android user, obviously you can give ahead and install Google Plus. I mean, it's Google, so obviously it exists. 176 reviews people seems to do enjoy it a lot and uh, what's so good about this is that we do know that Google haven't forgot about the iPhone app and uh, when Google was talking about the iPhone app or when uh, they were giving out a little update here about an iOS app basically when they say or when this person said that there was an iPhone app she said that there was an, a universal app basically what she means is that uh, it's going to work on iPhone, Apple Touch, and on the iPad because she calls iPad apps for iPhone apps. And uh, I mean, that's kind of obvious, or you know, it's kind of obvious that some people do that because the iPhone has been here for since like 2007, and uh, the iPad only for 2010. And, and it's so simple to just call it one app a universal app. So yeah, it's been submitted to the App Store and hopefully it will be approved by Apple because yeah, I'm not sure if Apple wanna approve a Google app, but hey, they've done it before. So it will probably be ready in the next couple of days. But uh, seriously, Google, you have to start up the invites again because I wanna try it out. So sweet.